Welcome back to Dark Souls, everyone. Don't adjust your microwaves. Yep, we're back in Huntsman's Cops, because, you know, we forgot to go kill the other boss in this, uh, fucking godforsaken area. But don't worry, we're gonna go correct that area right now and go fight all the fun enemies that are around that boss. Like, such as this man. And, um, uh, this torch wielding friend here. Ah, oh, dicks in orbit. Why do we even own a shield? Let's go. And there we go. That's how we deal with those boys. Give us a sickle. Give us a soul. I guess that's fine. No, why not? All right, let's kill that man. I mean, look at him. He's asking to be killed. Look what he's wearing. Ah. All right. That's a uh, let's win. <laughs> look at that wacky stick. I wish we could. Be. We don't. We can't get that weapon as wacky as it looks. We don't get any any wacky weapon like this thing. Would have been cool. Like give you a nice. Oh, if it gave you a grab move? Oh, how good would that be? Like, doing a backstab from any angle. That'd be something, man. Doesn't that sound pretty good? Okay, is there another wacky guy over here? Yep. Does this guy also have a catchy guy? Yep. And there we go. Beat him with our most powerful move. The stab forward move. Notched whip. Uh, yep. The... Notch whip is uh, very pixelated. It is uh, it's from the game Minecraft. It's the notched whip. So there's that joke out of the way. Holy shit! That's a bit of red. Anything on the floor that I need to worry about? Oh no, he saw me. Okay, let's, let's fight him. Oop! I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Come on, friend. I don't want to accidentally aggro your other guy. Blue Tearstone rings protect me. There we go. Uh, that was a close one. He did a spin move. Spin move almost got our goat. If it wasn't for the blue Tearstone ring, uh, we might have not made it out of that one. Aren't you supposed to get staggered by that? A little cracked red eye orb. Makes sense for uh, the company that's close by. And. Oh, actually, there's one right there if you look there. Careful, that one's not glowing red. Oh! Did you see that? Oh, this guy's. Uh, he's played this game before. Whack. Okay, let's shoot that one guy. Because fighting two of these guys must be a pain in the dick. I'm a bit overcompensating. You hurt yourself doing that. Whoo! Oh man, these guys are just on the whole like dodging arrows thing, except that time. And that time. No, good thing we got that one. Because, you know, I would hate to do this, but it's like that. Easy enough. And I feel a bit sluggish. Know what I'm saying? So, yeah, know what I mean? Oh, well, whatever. We can't be uh, perfect all the time. <laughs> Maybe I can, but uh, yeah. let's not let's not tell the enemies that one. Don't give up. I'm just expecting something. Okay, some paranoid. Oh, the, uh, the upgraded this man. Do we have anything wacky in the form of arrows? Ooh, poison arrows.
Why wouldn't you guys be out to get me? You can't just leave me in peace to go fight this new fancy red spirit. Will this hit the thing? Yep, it does have a hitbox. Okay, making sure. I mean, we got plenty of, like, time to waste, so... Ah, uh, no need in not taking our time. Alright, let's get with the... Good trade. Oh, well, my arrow falls out of him when he dies. That was neat. Or maybe it stayed in his invisible body. It used to be a knife. Oh, there it's. A knock. All right, we're just gonna have a little sip, have a little lifegaroom, life gem. This is what I said there. Shut up. And uh, yeah, let's have a good go at the um, the chariot boss. Oh yeah, there's a cutscene. There we are, with a very bland face. <laughs> That's a hint on how to beat the chariot. You see the um... The uh, the bits at the bottom of the uh, of the thing are pointed. And you know what else is pointed? Arrows, that's right. And arrows are the main way to defeat the chariot boss. Bullshit! Uh, maybe I was like really. Yeah, who knows? Okay, let's go find this other necromancer. You're not it. Now you can roll through them if you're a cool guy, but um, I'm not gonna bother. Okay, let's kill a few skelly boys. Excuse me. Now, we fight the boss the way it was intended to be fought. Can't ah, fuck. You kill all the necromancers, right? Alright, so. Okay. Now we're ready. Any second now. Ah, what a what a what a good what a good boss. Look at that! Look at that poison tick away. Hero of the boss. I wonder how many rotations the poison will last. Oh, it's not. Okay, we gotta knock the poison out this time. Just trying to get out of the way. Oh well. We got plenty of Estus. It's not like we're using it for anything else. There goes the poison taking away again. Ah, it's good to know that poison still affects the undead. Right? And that's pretty good. Good little uh, smidgen of uh, info there. Uh, there goes the poison again. Let's knock another one of those poison arrows. 
good old reliables, as I like to call them. Didn't, didn't quite get it that time. But hopefully he still has a bit of poison built up from that go around to this go around. Oh. Ah, uh, what, what a poor horsey. Well... Like, um... Like, Lassie and Old Yeller, or whatever that movie was. We, got, we gotta put you down. We gotta put you down, boy. You're off to the glue factory now. Good night. Yay! Victory achieved! We did it! We were one of the best rings in the game. Well, wasn't that a good time? Yeah, this is this boss is a nice little wacky break for all the real boss. <laughs> like covetous demon. What a real boss that was. Remember him? What a boy. All right, let's uh, let's light a bonfire and say bye bye. Hello, Tetchy Gren. That guy, his uh, his middle bit, his uh, torso armor bit increases soul gain. So you know, you can get a little murderous if you want to come here and get one of those. Well, uh, like the video if it was all right, and uh, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye!